a skin rat doing here eating my cereal? Harry, you're alive! <laughs> I did not consent to this touching. I thought you were dead. I'm so glad you're okay. Can you go to the store and buy yourself one of those little trampolines? Cool. Yes, then take it to the ceiling fan store just down the road. Turn on the overhead ceiling fans and trampoline into them so that your head chops off. That's rude. Why are you being mean? Because you are the reason I am stuck here. Do you want to see what my spaceship looks like? Hmm? This, this is what is left. I had the coolest whip in town. You now they have a box of alien balls. If it wasn't for you, I would be on my planet right now, eating delicious tree skin. It's like pork rind, but it doesn't make you vomit. You can pretend you don't like me, but I know you do. You saved my life in the ship. I did not. Yes, you did. You protected me during the crash. Like, like you were my dad. How dare you? You take that back. You want to be my father. I am your father. OK, I'll be your father. You are a bad boy. What? Yes. This hurts me as much as it hurts you. Oh, this is so inappropriate. You are inappropriate. This is why we can't have nice things. You can say whatever you want, but you can't take back what happened. You saved me because you loved me. I don't even remember the crash. You know why? Because you are meaningless to me, you stupid little jerk. I know you are, but what am I? I... No, I did not say that I am a jerk. I said that you are a jerk. I know you are, but what am I? You are not hearing me correctly. The pronoun is you, not I. I know you are, but what am I? <sighs> I'm going into that room over there. When I come out, you better be gone, you dumb little shit pocket. That makes no sense. Yes, it does. If you put shit in your pocket. Memories define who these humans are. And if the memories become too painful, or reveal a side of themselves they don't like, their brains tuck those memories away. I am so happy I am not human. <laughs>